video is an overview of the Outdoor and Experiential Education Program at Queen's University. This program is for applicants who already have a university degree. The Outdoor and Experiential Education Program, often referred to as OEE, is designed to introduce teacher candidates to the variety of ways in which outdoor and experiential programs can be offered in various school and community settings. Students in the program develop the leadership skills required to implement outdoor and experiential programs. OEE program is full of special activities, workshops, and events that help build community and lead to a better understanding of outdoor education. In late August, program orientation is held at a field camp. There are opportunities to participate in outdoor workshops, conferences, and more throughout the program. The Faculty of Education has a garden that is looked after by students in the Outdoor and Experiential Education program. The OEE program is looking for students who can bring in unique perspectives and a range of experiences to our community so that our students can learn from one another. We don't expect all of our students to come fully loaded with certifications and years of experience. We attempt to accept a variety of students to the OEE program. Why Queens? Now that you know a little bit more about our program, you might be wondering. Queens University is one of the highest ranked post-secondary institutions in Canada when it comes to student experience. We take an inclusive approach to education and offer learning experiences beyond the classroom. Why should you come to the Faculty of Education? Our program begins in May and finishes in August the following year. This means that our graduates are out into the working world a year earlier than most other universities. The job market is excellent for classroom teachers right now, and we wanna get you into the classroom as soon as possible. Many of our courses are taught by faculty members, meaning that you are learning from the people who are shaping the research in your chosen area. We have a full team of support staff here for you. Not only do we have embedded counselors, but we also have a full team of academic and career advisors that will assist you in your job search, interviewing, and your resume. Queen's is one of, only, one of the only universities across Canada that has specific education career services. This allows us to be specialized in securing teaching and education related careers for you. When you apply to our program, you apply to teach either primary junior, which is junior kindergarten to grade six, or intermediate senior, which is grades seven to 12. These are the recommendations for applicants applying to our consecutive education program. In addition to having a four-year honors undergraduate degree and a minimum B average, we strongly encourage all applicants to have a half-year course in developmental psychology or a full-year course in introductory psychology. For primary junior, we look for applicants that are well-rounded. We recommend having at least one course in English, math, science, the arts, geography, Canadian history, and health or physical science. These are the key areas of the Ontario curriculum. If you're applying to the Intermediate Senior Program, you will need to choose two teaching subjects when you apply. You can check our website for specific teaching subject requirements. For your first teaching subject, you need five full year courses, and for your second, you need three full year courses. There are some exceptions. Some things to keep in mind, for example, if you're interested in having chemistry as one of your teaching subjects, you need to have at least one organic chemistry course. If you're interested in history, we encourage applicants to have a Canadian history course. We will accept up to one full year related course or a course outside of the Department of Study. For example, if you are applying to biology, but you have a health science course with a lots of biology content in it, we might accept that. Our program is condensed, meaning that instead of using the standard school year structure with summers off, our students start in May and continue straight through to the following August. It's important to keep in mind that while this gets you on the job market quickly, there isn't time for breaks in the program. Our program consists of blocks, as you can see from the schedule. There are class blocks and practicum blocks. The structure of our program allows students to learn from our faculty in Kingston and apply that learning through the year in their practicums. Queens, you will complete 18 weeks of practicum in a publicly funded Ontario classroom. Our catchment area includes 26 district school boards spanning from Burlington to Cornwall. We will follow the associate school model where we aim to have all of our teacher candidates complete all regular practicum components in the same associate school. OEE students have three weeks of winter practicum in an outdoor facility. When you are admitted to the program, you will identify four district school boards within the designated catchment area with the potential to be placed within any of those four boards. We do our best to place candidates within a one-hour commute of their home address, but this is not always possible. 
Due to the high demand for the local kinks and school boards and the limited spaces available in these boards, you should be prepared to be placed in any of your four school board choices. This means that while you will be in Kingston for your class blocks, you could be elsewhere in the province for your practicum placements. You will be assigned a Queen's faculty liaison to support you during practicum, who will visit you in your classroom twice during the program, once in the fall and once in the winter. Practicum placements are arranged by the practicum office at Queen's. Unfortunately, you're not permitted to arrange your own. Here is a list of the public school boards we use. And here is a list of the Catholic school boards. The three week alternative practicum is typically completed outside the school system and takes place in the winter term after March break. For OEE teacher candidates, the alternative practicum takes place in a non-traditional outdoor-based setting anywhere in the world, and there are travel fellowships available to help you get there. Above, you can see recent OEE grad, Amy Newham, who completed her alternative practicum at the Hawaii Nature Center. We've had students complete alternative practicums in forest schools, national parks, nature centers. The possibilities are endless. Ready to apply? You apply for our program on the uac -TS website. This is the same website that you would have used if you applied for universities in Ontario for your last degree. We have a specific portal for teaching applications called TEAS, which you can find under the Professional Programs heading. Applications usually open in September and remain open until December 1st. After you have received your application, you will receive an email link with information about the personal statement of experience, including how to submit it. The personal statement of experience is due by December 10th. As an OEE applicant, you are also required to submit supplemental documents. These documents include letters of reference, a letter of introduction, a resume, an alternative resume, and a personal artifact. Here are the key dates and deadlines for the application process. Queen sends out the first round of offers for admission in mid-February with a deadline to accept by March 1st. Please note that because our program begins on May 1st, all of our deadlines are firm. We can't wait to welcome you to the Faculty of Education at Queen's University. Please contact us with any questions you